Hello, kamusta? Mabuhay, magandang umagan. Welcome back to MGN Diego. I was your villa and I just reacted to Marcelito uh, performing I Believe in You, which is a very old performance of his, you know, eight years ago. And I'm not gonna tell you what I think about it, but you know, just go check it out for yourself. But now I will be reacting to him uh, singing Power of Love. And I believe I have reacted to Marcelito Pomoy singing this song. But this video right here is, I think, the most recent one. And it occurred apparently in August 2019. So it will give us a better idea of how he is able to perform it, you know. Um, so there you go. Before we start, please consider following me on Instagram at Music Game News. Yes, we are back on that Marcelito Pomoy craze. All right, let's get it going. Oh, wait, but before we start, you know those teasers that you can find on the channel? Well, you can watch the full reaction video exclusively on Patreon, so don't hesitate to check it out. Wow. Cool girl. Ooh, that oh. See, the difference between Power of Love and I Believe in You, I think Power of Love is more popular. So, uh, singing Power of Love gives you the chance to impress a wider array of people. <laughs> I love it, the voice lur. <laughs> He's actually imitating Celine Dion and I mentioned it in my I Believe You uh, reaction video that uh, eight years ago when he was I mean, singing a Celine Dion song, he did not actually sound like her. But right now, he is singing like her, but also imi imitating her voice, you know? With their her. Yeah. Maybe he should do this on AGT, you know, make it a little bit more funny. Look at him feeling all comfortable. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> You know who does this, right? Who actually manages to imitate, sing beautifully, but also be funny about it? Katrina Velarde. That was not so good. He, he slipped like a millisecond. He slipped there. Was that him, that voice? Yeah, lady. I'm not so sure. Let me rewind. 
<laughs> okay, that was him. <laughs> Such an amazing, powerful voice. It's very impressive that he can sing like Celine Dion. My God, this is a man right there. He is clearly not as concentrated as usual. Maybe, I don't know, maybe behind, you know, behind the scenes he drank a little bit, he's feeling good, you know, he just wants to have fun. That's the impression that I'm having. That's why you can see him just joking around. And I'm saying this because he is not singing it perfectly. I can hear some slip ups here and there, you know? But you know, when it counts the most, he hits the notes right and he can hold them for a very long time. You are my girl. I feel like that part is the hardest for him to hit, you know, because you go from that extremely high range note to that lower one. So in between, it's hard to control your voice to keep it steady. <laughs> I love him. I love him. Now you see, I don't know, should he be funny on stage on the AGT stage? Because the two previous uh, performances, he was extremely serious. Almost too serious, you know? He was stoic and singing. That's it. We could feel the emotion in his vocal cords, but not in his uh physical presence you know so maybe he should be a little funny in between if he can manage it if he can manage it but i don't know so uh i honestly think he can sing this song to a perfection i mean did you did you hear him hit the, the last note that note is so difficult to hit and he hit it like it was really no like it was nothing Honestly, so I I think he will nail this song if he sings it on uh, AGT. He needs to make it his own, of course, because obviously here there is no contrast, you know, like he's not using multiple voices. It's still a man singing like a woman. But the contrast is not there. The surprise, you know, that he brought in the two previous performances is not there. So... Who, can he win with this if he sings it to a perfection and makes it his own and maybe if he gets like a an orchestra and backup vocalist or something I think he can 
especially if you compare him to the other performance the other performers if you know they don't nail their performances i don't know and again i don't know who is judging so i have no idea but i just reacted to his performance of uh, celine dion and el divo and honestly if he has the time to practice to sing i believe in you and manages to imitate four male voices plus a female voice which is celine dion's and sing in french oh my god that that would be very impressive if he sings it to a perfection that would be impressive i think even if he doesn't uh you know make it his own you know i believe in you i think he would still win with that one if he doesn't make any mistakes so it's a tough one it's really a tough one <sighs> like tell me in the comment section below if uh, which song do you know do you do you know uh i believe in you of uh, celine dion and el divo do you know power of love which one do you think is more popular you know if it's the judges who vote the popularity of the song doesn't really matter but if it's the people that vote then it does matter because whether you like it or not you connect more with the song that you are familiar with okay and i think uh power of love is more popular than i believe in you there you go i could talk about this for hours so i'm not going to do that right here i think i'm gonna just make a brand new video of me just uh mentioning all the songs that you guys sent me that you think marcelito pomoy should sing during the agt finals um so it's your turn to tell me in the comment section below your thoughts about this performance and if you watched my uh reaction video of i believe in you give me your comparison of the two i would really like that so, as usual, thank you so much for joining me. Have a great day, and I will catch you in the next one. As usual, peace. Thank you for watching. Subscribe here, and please like the video to show your support and appreciation for my work, and turn on the notification bell to be poked for future content. Yeah, yeah, yeah.